Hello again, everybody, and I am Justin Pontarelli, and I am back with some more Interstellar Pilot, and yes, this is going to be episode number 15 of A Pirate's Life, featuring myself as Don Carnage, just without the wonderful pirate voice. <laughs> um, guys, I'm here... We really, you know, really at this point, really firmly settled into the new house in Pittsburgh, New York. Um, nice little town here where we are. Um, can't say nothing bad about it at all. Um, I used to, we used to go to a, you know, a rather large Wegmans where I used to live. But now we've got this little tiny really old-fashioned Wegmans. I love it. It's great. Um, really convenient right up the street. Tiny little thing, though. I love it, though. I really do. Um, but right now, it's like 74 degrees or so inside the house. I was outside a little while ago. Did a little kite flying. Thought about recording it, but I was failing too many times because, first of all, despite the wind, and there's plenty of wind right now, the little park I have access to has way too many trees, and a lot of the wind is being blocked. But, all of a sudden, boom, I'm like, wait a second. There's a nice church with a wide open field right behind my house. Lo and behold, I give that a try, and the kite just goes right up in the air. <laughs> it was great. But now I'm, like, whipped. I'm hot. I'm in my room with my shirt off. And I'm used to, you know living in a basement where I used to live, in Henrietta, where there's always cool air because it's the basement. But now I'm upstairs and, you know, I can finally understand why my brother walks around without a shirt because it's always hot upstairs. Especially when it's 74 degrees and your windows, your blinds are down, or I should, I should say your blinds are up, letting all the sun shine through. In reality, I should probably put my uh, my uh, blinds down, I should say, and block out the sun, but I love the light streaming in, so that's not an option. So here I am, getting ready to do some Interstellar Pilot with my shirt off. <laughs> Alright, enough of me yammering, let's get into this, shall we? So, yep, here we go. Don Carnage, only 31,000 credits, but that's because we're working on another ship. Okay, we have another Orion. That's going to primarily be a base guard. Okay. Here we are in the Gatopia sector. Kind of flying off into space in the Avenger. And again... Justin Pontarelli of Black Sail. I'm sorry, <laughs> Don Carnage of Black Sail. My apologies, guys. Okay, we're in Gatopia, aren't we? Let's go to ship orders. Return to base. Okay. Let's just sort through some of these, shall we? Well, that can't be right. Another Orion? No. I don't believe it for a second. That's, that's, that's a miracle. Alright, let's get rid of the turrets. And here's the ship I'm working on. Let me just pop in there real quick for you guys. Check this out. So I'm not sure where he's going. Oh, he's returning to base, that's fine. Uh, let's go with the uh, ship. Components. Now, we have everything we really need, except for the shielding. The shielding is not yet at full, okay? Uh, I believe everything else is at, you know, at max, at least as far as I need it to be. Okay? So if we really have... We really do, wow, okay. The Saint, interesting. We'll go ahead and have one of our other ships pick that up real fast. Uh, let's go with the... With the Conquered. Is off in Beta Pandola. And maybe he's already on top of it. 
Oh, look at that. He is awesome. That's amazing. Spectacular. Look at that. There's our target. That is perfect. Out here all by himself. Just waiting to be scooped up. Little prize. Love it. Oh man. This is perfect. Here's what we're going to do, fellas. Okay, we're going to take a look around real quick. If there's any ships out here, we should see them real fast, okay? So here's what we're going to do. We're going to... Oh, does not, not, not scan. Okay. Target claim. Properties. Okay. Orders. Okay. Settings. Remember? Doc. Cloak. And get rid of these two. We don't want them. He don't want him flying off to do anything silly. I'll go back to dock at my waypoint. There we go. Now remember not to repair at waypoint. Just dock at right waypoint. This guy too. Let's send him back to dock at my waypoint. No better yet. Let's have him ship orders and return to base. So yeah, this must have popped up um, right after. I closed out the video, okay? So nothing major, I sent him out here to pick up this guy here, to pick up the abandoned ship. And that should really fix us in terms of the money situation, okay? And get us back on track. And it should also allow us to fully equip our uh, new vessel too, okay? In terms of the Avenger, let's pop in the Vulture first. Let's, uh, let's go to Request Taxi. Guys, check this out. Enemies galore. Just, wow, right? Drolla. What is that, anyway? Hmm. Okay. Well, that's something. Just to quickly check out our... Uh, oh yeah, all the lasers are back in great shape. Okay. Nothing major there. Yeah, we're fine. Let's hop back in the base, guys. Okay. Request taxi. So in Androla, there's only the one brewery. Um, I do believe I kicked out the DSMC out of this area. My map is doing great. Trekos has still the one refinery and the orbital farm of the TEF. Let's see here. Everything's in great shape here. This might be a great place to pick up some jobs. Galene. Got the Stallion Repair Shop. Epsilon Shipyard. Orco. Nothing major going on there. That's fine. Um, repair Shop and a military base. In Beta Pandola. Yes, I believe the outpost of Fortuna is a military base. And of course, Solace, same thing military base, repair shop, hospital, and a jewelry factory. Nothing major. So, okay. So, I think what we want to do, in my opinion, is either make some more money and just pick up some jobs, or for fun, try to go back to the Trekos area and knock out the DSMC out of the area. But the problematic part with that would be simply that. We have no nearby places to get repaired. But let me just double check that, guys. So in Trekos, we do have access to Halimus or Androla. So it's not like we don't have nearby areas to actually get uh, supplies, but it doesn't really help when they're so far away, though. Okay. Like, we could go here, right, to Halimus. Okay. And Telemus is like right down there, or Dimapa, or even Beta Pandola, and to get, to get supplies. 
But anyway, it is a long hike to do that kind of thing, and you're probably losing money the entire time, so that's part of the problem. Okay. So as far as my, um... You know, as far as my attack plan, you know, the attack plan is don't get caught up doing things, you know, you really can't afford to do, you know. But, if you want to have some fun, then it might be good to go ahead and, you know, spend some money to have a little fun, right? Alright, so right now we're just taking a look, making sure we're maxed out. Again, we could put on a passenger module, but I really don't necessarily want to. Medium is only good for five guys anyway, so it's not a big deal. Um, cloak, we got our cloak. And yeah, we could get a better cloak, uh, like this for example. Okay. Notice the cloak time is only 1.2, for example. Okay. Cloak time here is 4. So... So yeah, the better cloaks, obviously, are better. Energy cost is 50.6. I have a hard time believing that the energy cost is the same, so I just don't think so. I think it also costs more to get the cloak ready to go, you know? Costs more time, I should say. Anyway, so the ship is exactly what I want it to be at this point. We have, let's see, make sure, yep, we're all stocked. The hazard is ready to fly, okay? I don't want those, so back to our messages and double check this one yep that one's done at this point all these I think are just the Raptors it's not really worth my time or effort see just Raptors double check the last one for fun and Raptor yeah so if we have to those can be set aside for later okay um, make sure this guy has his orders now, we're not going to have them actually physically guarding the base because what's going to happen is any ship that's going to come close, he's going to go out and viciously attack it. We don't want that to happen, okay? Just because he will be fighting alone, okay? And I don't want to mess with the aggression bar, so let's not do that. So he'll just prefer to dock and cloak, and he'll just stay here. But when I get the message that my base is under attack, I can pop into my my ship and fix the problem, okay? So for right now, let's hop into the Vulture. Request taxi. I want to say to... Lemus, maybe? And go to the job board. Epsilon. Oh, that's a, that's a big mission there. Let's see if we're at war with Epsilon, although I'm not too keen on getting my uh, my butt kicked by an Overlord. Okay. Let's see who we're at war with right now. We are not at war with Epsilon, and I don't need a war with Epsilon, so that's all there is to it. <laughs> as far as Titan, I don't think we're at war with... I don't think we're at war with Titan yet. And this would not be worth the fight. Not enough money for what looks like a potential ambush. But again, just in case, let's just double check the list. I want to see if, if we're at war with Titan. We are not, so that's great. Okay. As far as the list of guys that like me, the list is growing. Hightower, Azure. Again, a lot of these are like little no-namer guys. But the rest of them are, you know, fairly decent, you know, in terms of, uh, well, they're decent in terms of, um, you know, they got bases, ships, stuff like that, I guess. I don't know what I'm saying. Anyway, in terms of power, Lambda, the Terrans are still on top, followed by El Gahat, Hightower, Black Sail, you know, Apollo Lynx, whatever. Okay. And in terms of wealth... Surprisingly, High Tower and Lynx are supposedly at the top. They're rolling in it. Okay. Hera's Affluent. Terrans. Lambda. 
Noob Space Binding is down there, so... Let's see, let's request Taxi to the other place, Axis, Job Board, and just a delivery mission. So we're going to skip on that. This might be an okay place to get uh, a job at. So turret, that's fine. Ooh, oh, Magnus. Okay, I thought it was destroy a Magnus. <laughs> no, of course not. Eight. No, I'm not gonna. No, that's that's dumb. Apex. I don't think we're at war with Apex. Let's check. Guys, I got a bad short-term memory, uh, so I've got to check this a lot. Yeah, we're not at war with them, so that's fine. We're at war with Zeta, though. Eighteen thousand, though. Trisk probably guaranteed death is like, eh, I don't know, that's, that's kind of iffy. Are we worth Empire? I, I keep, I'm sorry, I, I just checked that deny, guys, I'm sorry. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna check again, because, yeah, okay, we are worth Empire, and Zeta. Well, um... We'll risk it. Okay. Let's hop in the Avenger. We got a waypoint set up, I suppose. Move direct. No, 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 no. Shoot. Let's do this log, mission log. Androla, hold on. Let's go there. Let's go to dock at... There we go. That's better. Okay. In the meantime, while we're waiting for that to happen, we can also do other things as well, okay? So, you know... Guys, once you have more ships and you have a base, you can, you know, you can multitask. You know, not a problem at all. Now that we have a hauler, we can use a hauler as well. Huh. Falling goods, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Let's go to the repair shop, Bean and Drolla, shall we? Repair shop, B and Androla. Dock at... Repair shop, B and Androla. Look at that. So now we're going to try another mission, guys, okay? Not a big deal. But we do... Okay, that that is on. That's good. Oh, that's perfect. Okay. No, wrong thing. <laughs> It's so hot, I'm so, like, out of it, kind of. It's like, ugh, man, I'm telling you. That's way over here, wow. Okay, so we're way over here. Gives me some backup, right? So we're gonna check on our uh, scanner now. For our t oh, what's going on there? Look at that. Interesting, huh, guys? Wow. And that's what happens, you know, you get involved with bandits and you get yourself destroyed, I guess. Anyway.
That is not good. This is not the kind of stuff we wanted to have happening. Oopsie. Come on. I'm hoping we don't get, you know, in trouble with our bandit friends. Sometimes, you know, sometimes what happens is you launch your missiles and they accidentally hit other, you know, other here, uh, you know, the bandits, other bandits. And you get in trouble that way. Come on, silly thing. Let's go. Uh oh, uh oh, we gotta fly, we gotta fly. Shoot, no, 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 oh, no, not the power generator. Come on, oh, no, no. Yeah, we're in, we're in, we're in trouble here, guys. We're in serious trouble. Let's see about the damages. Shields, engines. Oh, we are, we're out for the count. This. Wow. Oh my goodness. Well, the good news is that it looks like the battle's gonna be over for us, and that the Overlord's gonna be, you know, taken care of. Bad news is, well, um... This little fella here took a lot of damage. Is that really just... oof. So, you know, yeah, I got the money, you know, that's fine and all that, but it's going to be a lot of repairing. See, it's like half what I just... No, it's like over half what I just got. So we lost money on that one. Let's go return to base, I guess. That's fine. Okay. That's fine. Good news is we can... Another turret? That's fine. Let's do mission log. We want to get, change this over to, uh, oh. Huh. Haven't noticed that button before. Well, there we go. Pick up cargo. Let's go then. Change the guidance to the, it's going to be the outpost in black sail. Or Dimapa, whatever. Orders. Dock at. No, wait. <laughs> Dock at. Outpost A and Dimapa. That's fine. So he can uh, he can do whatever he's gonna do, some non pirate stuff, you know. And make some money that way, okay? It's not really piratical of us, but you know what? Money is money. And after a loss like that that we just took, I mean you know what it was? I wasn't watching the scanner well enough, okay? So, like I said, guys, whenever you're entering a sector, honestly, always check your scanners, okay? Check out where the nearest bases are, you know, where the nearest enemy turret happens to be, you know, where the en you know nearest enemy vessels are, because you want to stay safe. And yeah, the cloaking device helps a lot, um, but when you decloak, again, 
double check where you are, make sure you're not going to decloak somewhere where you're not safe. Because if you're like 400 some odd, you know, away from an enemy turret, and you get fired upon, well guess what, you're not going to last very long, okay? Especially if you decloak and you're like in the midst of like, if you're nearby like a bunch of enemy vessels. Especially things like hornets. They're going to like instantly swarm you. Just don't do it, okay? <laughs> anyway. Here we go, get rid of that one there too. Let's see here. Well, here we are. He's back at base. He's already repaired, that's right. Got our weaponry back. Looking good, that's fine. Request taxi. Um, so 37,000 credits, that's not a lot. You know, it's really not. Let's maybe try links here. Job board. Courier, no, no, thank you. We're not at war with Apex, so we don't want to do that. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. This is 31,000 for this kind of battle. I don't know. This kind of battle could be pretty tough. So we're going to kind of pass on that one. Just coming out to main base to uh, pick another place to travel off to. Um, what we'll do, I guess... You know what? Oh, let's hold on. Let's take a look real quick. Maybe here, I guess? There we go. Let's try over here. They don't like black sails, so let's not bother that. At this point, it's kind of, you know, getting tough to find a nice place to go to to, you know, make some damage. Tractos Profit, maybe? Try Lambda and Aries? That's, that's quick, easy money. Gamma? Whoa, that's, that's a lot. TEF? That's not bad. We could do that. Let's do that. Repair shop, profit and trekos. Repair shop, profit, trekos, right? There we go. Let's do it. Repair shop, profit, trekos. Repair shop, Profit Trekos. Where's Trekos? There's Trekos. There's my repair shop. Right there. Okay. So we're waiting for him to go over to that area. He's still really far away. This guy's just taking his jolly time. You know, so guys, this is why, in my opinion, you know, being a pirate is not necessarily the fastest way to make money. Um, in my opinion, it is a slow, uh, slow process. And being a pirate can honestly be pretty slow. <laughs> One sec, fellas. Anyway, here we are. Sorry about that. I had to pause the recording for a second. But yeah, guys, um, piracy is slow. Okay. Um, 
It is really much better. Oh, black sail. Oh. I'm at the wrong outpost. That's why. Okay. If you think about what I'm doing right, it's... Just going from place to place, blowing stuff up, trying to collect bounties, fighting. You know, the, the, the work is erratic. If you take too much damage, right? You lose money. If you don't take and you know, if you don't take too much damage, yeah, sure you, you gain money, but not a lot necessarily. Hmm. All Titan. Hmm. That's cool. Not really. That's bad. Let's make this job quick, shall we? At war, at war, at war. Oh, that's not good. We're going to try to get him to a... Um... The other place, yeah, this place, let's, do, let's go there. You might have some fun stuff to do, right? Okay. But, um, guys, any, any time, I would always advocate no problem. Um... You know... Make a taxi service, get some miners going, right? Because um, you, you just you need those things. You you really do. You need those things. Okay. Miners, haulers, you know, get some automatic trade routes going. Do some taxi servicing, you know, services. Okay. Get some stuff going in the background that's going to make you money. Being the bad guy, being the villain, being a pirate, this is hard work. This is hard, methodical work. Okay. And who is out there that wants to kill us? Oh, he might not want to kill us. Let's see what he's doing. He's just going to buy some gold. He's he's not going to touch us, I bet. Any money, he's not going to do anything. We'll just decloak and see what he does. Yeah, he's, he's not coming after us. He's on, he's on, a, he's on a job run, so we're, we're good. But yeah, so... So far, so good, I suppose. You know, 40,000... 40 plus thousand in the kitty. Um, plenty of cash, you know. It's fine, right? For now. We got two fully loaded vessels... We'll wait for this guy here to do is we'll just we'll just wait. We're not gonna stop this run right now, but anyway. Oh, here we are, here we are, here we are. Get on your scanner, right? I was get on your scanner, guys. That's what I said, right? Get on the scanner. If you ignore the scanner, you're in trouble. Ignore it at your own will, at your own risk. So not a big deal in terms of ships. The uh, Ares is kind of... is going to be a big deal, in my opinion. But if we're, if we're fast about this, we should be fine, realistically. Let's put on some speed, shall we? So at this point, we're just going to do our typical strategy. Just kind of basically a duck and run type of thing. Fire missiles as you go. Typically, it's going to get some ships knocked out. Retreat to a nice safe uh, safe point. Look at that one. One's already going to go down right now. Betcha.
13,000 bounty from the TEF. <laughs> we'll slow down a little bit, shall we? Okay, we need some missiles. We really need some missiles. Oh, okay, we need to go somewhere to get missiles. Okay, that's fine. Ship orders, dock at my waypoint. So far, so good. No damage. A lot of missiles, though. That's fine. Alright, what are we going to do here? I forgot. Uh, I think trade, maybe? Or no, no, job board. Job board. Okay. Living fall yeah, that's great. Let's do it. So let's go to the outpost A in Solace. Orders. Dock at. Outpost A in Solace. There we go. Now guys, just as a quick FYI, in case anyone's interested to know, I do prefer um, custom maps over the built-ins. I think Uncharted Space is great if you're starting off, okay? It really is. And why... Where's the... Uh... Okay. Oh, okay, there's no weaponry places here. Awesome. Okay. That was uh, my mistake. I thought it was in the Lambda sector for some reason. There we go, we'll just pick up some more weaponry and come back here and... Uh, Blow something up. In the meantime, maybe the job will be done for us. It does happen sometimes. In the meantime, we're just going to hop in here and uh, request taxi and find another thing to do. So again, guys, we might go back here to Trekos and try this out. Okay. Go here, try to knock out that DM, DSMC base. Okay. If you look around, the, the normal areas that they, were, that they would be in, they're not here. Okay. Obviously not in Dimapa. They're knocked out already in Halimus. Okay, they're not going to be in Beta Pandola. Or maybe they are. Hm. There should be something here. But there's no intel here, so... Anyway, the idea is if we can knock them out of the Trekos area, that should knock out their last refinery, okay? And they're not going to hang out in this area, and typically there is another refinery over here, okay? In Beta Pandola, um, but that's... that should be something else altogether. There's some cargo. Probably not interested in that. Let's go back over here. Job board. Only the courier job. Oh, let's try this one again. Eagle. Job board. Uh, Epsilon. I. I don't think. Yeah, I don't think we're at war with them. I don't want to be at war with them. We already have enough enough war going on in this in this file. Okay. Well, let's just go back into our ship, see if they're if it's there yet, right? Probably close. 
And he's not close. He's way over. That thing's way out there. Okay. Well, we're waiting for fun. Let's check the bounty board, shall we? There's a ship on it in the Beta Pandola sector that we probably can't get to without killing ourselves. 47,000. Nice score, though, if I can get to it. Um, a couple of deep, deep space mining vessels in the Trekos area with some decent bounties on their heads. A lot of decent uh, stuff to take down over there. Lambda stuff's all over the place, I guess. Um, not a lot of TEF stuff anymore. I'm not seeing any TEF on the, on the board. Here we go. And we can finish this off. Okay, now we had a job to do. Make sure we're repaired first. And we are. That's awesome. We don't know. We gotta do mission log. We gotta get back to Trekos. Orders dock at something in Trekos. Anything friendly in Trekos. And... Yeah, not that. Bingo. All right. That's going to take a while, though. Hover bike's only five. Ah, pass. Okay. Now, one thing we could do that's relatively pirate, you know, piratical is we could hop in here, undock. Wait, let's do the cargo transfer first. Oh, it's just that stuff so far. Okay, that's cool. We can do this. Okay. Yeah, well, if we can find anyone coming in or out, right? So part of the idea is to, you know, anyone that comes in and out, knock them out, take their stuff, and go and sell it. But right now, the problematic thing would be this. I do believe we're at war with these guys. Right? Meaning that once again, we are, so... But that would typically be the pirate thing to do, right? You go, you raid a ship, take its cargo and sell it, okay? But right now, you can't go there because this area is going to be swarmed with lasers. Laser 3, laser 4, or 5, whatever. Or laser 3s, and other ships too, so... And since you can't maintain a cloak while exiting a base... You're going to get nailed as soon as you decloak, so... Um, now, this base was set up primarily just to kind of, you know, pick off bounties in the area. Which we can still do. Okay, where are we? That's fine, we're good. Okay. Let's go here. Down the waypoint. All right, let's go. Here we are. Let's finish this mission off here. Let's see what we got for. Uh, oh, he's still got plenty of stuff to use on me. Come on now, turn around. Oh, he wants me to take the fight to him. I I see. Yeah, you're under fire, big guy. Let's go. Come on. What you got, big fella? Ooh, ow, 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 ow. Knock it off, knock it off. Lost my shields. That's too bad. Oh, that's too bad.
Peace out. Nice. Yeah, we'll take your stuff, I guess. I'll just take that anyway. Okay. Um, let's see. You know, we'll take all this. We'll take all the stuff. Okay, that's fine. Let's go to a military. Let's get it. Let's get. Let's go to any military base. Cargo prices. Uh, let's see here. In the meantime, this guy should be at the outpost. He is, that's awesome. Let's try mission log, go there, and complete the mission. There's some more money in the kitty, right? Job board. Yeah, can't do that. Well, let's see what that is. Uh, not for 7,000 even. I mean, not with this thing anyway, but that's not the point. A Drake, a shuttle, and a raptor. I mean, it, it, I guess that mission's worth 11,000. Uh, okay. Outpost and I map a. What the heck? Oh, bandits. Okay. That's fine. He's going. Alright, guys. So, we're in the Halima sector, and... Lots of ships around here. I'm surprised there's any, any at all around here. He's going to the outpost. Okay, that's fine. So, getting kind of late into the video, right? So let's do this, I think. Um, let's have a little bit of fun. We'll just wait until we park here first. I think I want to go back to picking on uh, the DSMC, because making money right now is, is kind of going slow for me right now. It's, it's just going real slow. Only 70,000 credits. What is he doing? <laughs> anyway, that's great. Fair. Nope. Good. Um. Yeah, see, not, nothing really out there to do. So request taxi. Uh, let's go to Trekos. Yeah, I want to continue this right now. I really do. Let's go to the repair shop in Trekos, and let's go ahead and try to get some DSMC ships knocked out, shall we? Ship orders. Let's dock at that place in Trekos. And Trekos is only spilled with 1k. I gotta remember that. One minute, guys. We'll find it. Oops. Whoa, what happened? What happened? Right there. Okay, finally. 
I have a note on one of my videos that, you know, spells treckles with two Ks. I've got to fix that. If I get around to it, right? While we're waiting, let's knock this out because we don't want to respond to that. Check on him. He's nowhere close. We'll see how he's doing. The hazard. Get into hop into him. Maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe we'll find some ships with bounties on their heads. We don't want to start fights though, so. Maybe there's some ships here. In the uh, in the in the uh the TEF area. I don't think yeah, see it's just deep space mining basically at this point, Lambda. All the big TEF scores are dead. Um Yeah, so well, that's what happens, guys. You know, things start to, you know, dwindle down. When you're a pirate, things start off exciting at first, and then they kind of get boring. And then it's just, you know, hey, you got some money in in the pocket, but at the same time, it's not a lot. Well, what's over there? I could easily start a fight over there with Epsilon. Got the sector map. Yeah, it's, it's kind of a thing in it. Okay. I see we want to go over here, I think. We still want to go over there. Let's keep going over there. In terms of what's out there, I, I bet there's a lot more over there than we than we're seeing. Let's try the sector map. Yeah, I think it's the fog of war. Basically, <laughs> you can't see what's going on over there. But there's probably a lot over there to, to to you know to get into. So. All right. Um. Let's go back to our main vessel. What's that? 16,000 quick cash. Baby, baby. Okay, well, the prize. How fitting of a name, right? It's on patrol, too. I could probably pick him off so quickly. Um. Okay, that's fine on dock. Okay. So... We're gonna kind of swing around and find our uh, map. Let's just, yeah, okay. So basically we're gonna start swinging around and hopefully we can knock out that base. If not, it's gonna be really hard going. It really is. Right now, we want to stay hidden. That's all there is to it. Just want to keep an eye out for any possible... Uh... Bits of news, bits of... Uh... You know, explorers always have intel, maybe. You know, never know. And I see that once in a while between whatever you're doing. Either that refinery is not very well guarded, or all the miners are just kind of. Ooh, he's. Where is he? Ooh, wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Oh, man. Too tempting. 55 I got to you know I got to pause the game real quick
It's 55,000. He's got 8 ECM, which means he can dodge 8 of my missiles. But he only has one of his own with 12... Uh, I'm not sure what those are really. They're mid, mid, mid those are artillery. It's not a big deal, I don't think. He's got some big guns, though. Let's check out the uh, sector map. Look at that. Look at where he's going. He's going out there. Oh, that'll speed. This would be this would be the time to do it. This is the time to do it. Okay. Okay, big fella. Okay. There we go. Where's he going? Where's he going? Where's he going? There you go. Come on, get me. Let's go. Let's rumble. He is armed to the teeth. Shoot. This is not good. He is not going to be easy to push over. Or I should be specific and say he's not a pushover. Guys, I got in trouble doing this last time. Overlords are not pushovers, okay? They're not. They're, they're, they're just not. These, are, these guys are some of the beefiest in the game, in my opinion. Go into him though. I can't go into him. Oh no 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 no! Oh no no! Oh no! Oh no! This is the this is the bad part. This is the bad part. Out of missiles. Engine damaged. Ah, uh, we almost had him. You see that? You know, your eyes just get big with like, it's like, whoa. You know, and then stuff happens, and then you die. I was expecting worse. Um. We need cargo, though, so... <laughs> we will find you, and we will destroy you. <laughs> Can't change the waypoint now, but anyway. 
We're gonna get him though. We're we're gonna get him. I think we're gonna get him. Okay. Accept pick up cargo. Missions. No, not that one. Mission log. Deliver rocket fuel to the outpost in El Gahat. Outpost A in El Gahat, no problem. Double check. Yep, okay, yep. Outpost A, El Gahat, no problem. Okay, let's go. Orders dock at. I'm going to go to Galeen. El Gahat. Outpost A. Right there. There we go. So he'll go off and do his thing and get us some more money. In the meantime, I'm all like trying to figure out where our target is. There's anyway. Who's out there? I feel bad for leaving my post, but it's got to be done. We didn't lose him. Not worth it. Okay. This time we're gonna get some help. We got some reinforcements on the way, guys. Reinforcements on the way with about 10 minutes left in the game here, okay? And here we are in Trekos already. Right there, basically, 2k away, and counting. Okay. We are getting our target. That's all we're going to do. We're getting our target. We're getting our 55,000. That is a lot. We're gonna find them, we're gonna bust them up. That's all I'm gonna say, guys. This is a big score, I'm not letting it get away. Man, the challenge alone is just awesome. Okay? This is not just some wussy random vessel that, you know... It's not. It's not at all.
Where'd you go? A new one? Is he all patched up? That can't be right. Did you lose it? Where does he go anyway? Hmm. Well, this is the uh, place to be in terms of. This is where all the action is, isn't it, guys? It's right here. What is it? Base 2. here. The big fella was here just a while ago. The lambdas all over the places, and aren't they? Just like lambda, lambda. Guys, this is the main, this is where all the action is, and unfortunately there's just too much around. Okay, let's do this. Let's... We may have to send this guy home. Um, let's see where we are here. Okay. No one's around us. Let's uncloak. Alright, guys. Let's just at least take care of some business, right? One. Two. Three. One, two, three. You get him? We got him. All right. Get the heck out of here.
piece right here, so we'll just pick up the slack right here, guys. We're gonna try to knock that thing out again. Um, I know this is risky business, but we've got to do it. Here comes the party. That's not good. One. Two, three, one, bingo. This is thing of the watchdog. Look at me, heck, heck, by the watchdog. Let us off to play. He's like, no, 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 man. No, you can't do that. I'm sorry, Fido, but I have to. It's like my job, you know? Watch out for that, um, that guy right there. Controller. Yeah, they're gonna, they're gonna, they're gonna knock him around like crazy. time here guys I don't know what's gonna happen being targeted now with the fellas see you DSMC nice knowing you Look at that, guys. Look at that. Awesome, right? Awesome. That's all she wrote, though, for today, guys. That's all she wrote, though. Yeah, I don't think we're going to do anything else today. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, that's that's that, this is all she wrote for today, guys. That's all she wrote. We're out of here. We gotta get out of here. The missiles left. We gotta get out of uh, range and get out of range fast. Okay. Range five hundred. Range seven hundred, four hundred on that ship, on the last ship on the list. Four thirty. Good enough. Let's let's cloak. Bingo. Ship. Orders. Return to base. Property. The hazard is home. Guys, that was fun. I mean, that was... That was awesome. <laughs> that was great. So guys, basically on the next episode, we're going to uh, revel in the fact that we took down 
a, a base in the, uh, we took down another DMC base, or sorry, a DSMC base. Andrilla, right? DSMC, gone. Trekos, DSMC, gone. Halimus, DSMC, gone. Beta Pandola, maybe not, but that's okay. Um, let's double check real quick. No intel, that's fine. Okay, so, um, we're gonna clear out all these messages. Ooh, look at this one. Holler M, nice. So, guys, we got some stuff to do when we get back, you know, on the next episode because, uh, we got money on the board, another ship to pick up. We're doing fine, guys. We're doing just fine. And once again, as I fly off into the proverbial sunset, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching the video today. Uh, please leave any questions, comments, and or constructive criticism in the comments down below. This has been Justin Pontarelli as Don Carnage, the not-so-infamous Pirates of Black Sail, or sorry, Black Sun, signing off for right now and saying, guys, take care, and uh, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll play again next time. See ya.